Hello everyone, today we will solve another homogeneous differential equation. So this is our given, we set v is equals to uz. So we differentiate the v, It is we use the product rule, we arrive into u dz plus a du. So now we have to substitute our all the v variable into u multiplied by z. So this is our, this is what we arrive into. So we have 5uz minus u divided by du plus. So in this part, we d we're just going to distribute everything. So we have 3u squared z minus 2, 7, 7u squared dz plus 3uz squared minus 7uz du. It's all equals to 0. So now... We have to simplify it. So we have negative 7 uz here at the right side. And in the left side, we have 5 uz. So we just have to subtract it. We arrive into negative 2 uz. So after simplifying, we have to divide everything by u. So we arrive into 3 z minus 2 z minus 1 multiplied by du plus 3z minus z 7 multiplied by u dv. So we shouldn't forget the dv. So by by uh, um what do you call this by uh, mm, Via manipulation, we arrive into d over u plus 3z minus 7 multiplied by 3z squared minus 2z minus 1. So, in this part, the u substitution won't work. So, we have to use the partial fraction integration. So, we have to factor out our denominator. So, we know that d over u is simply ln u plus c. And we have to integrate our second part by a uh, um, partial fraction integration so i'm just gonna erase this part and then let's solve the second part it'll be a little bit tricky because um partial fraction integration as we all know is have very long process so 3z minus 7 um the the um the factors are 3z plus 1 multiplied by z minus 1 so we set a is equals to 3z plus 1 and b by 2z minus 1. So using LCD, so we arrive in this one. Um, that is why. So um, a multiplied by... 1 all over 3z plus 1 multiplied by z minus 1, we arrive into a z minus 1. b multiplied by b over z minus 1 multiplied by 1 over 3z plus 1 multiplied by z minus 1, we arrive into b, b multiplied by 3z plus 1. So we set z is equals to 1, b will be equals to negative 1. When we set z is equals to negative 1 third, a will be equals to 6. So simply, we just have to substitute our values of b and a. So the reason why it is negative, it's because our b, we arrive into a negative value. That's why it's negative. So in integrating it, we will arrive into 2ln. 3z plus 1. So we set u is equals to 3z plus 1 and du is equals to 3. 6 divided by 3 is just 2. So we have a coefficient of 2. And the second part, it's just the integration of that. It's just ln z minus 1. So we just have to write it all out. So we have ln u plus 2 ln of 3z plus 1 minus ln of z minus 1. It's all equals to c. Which is our constant. 
So simple, we just have to use the rule of natural log logarithm. First rule, I'm just gonna write the rule so that you will be familiarized because these are the rules that are usually used in our homogeneous differential equation. So we have n ln of x. So simply, we just have to make our n our exponent. So ln x plus ln y is equals to ln of x multiplied by y. And the next is ln of x minus ln of y is equals to ln x all over y. So that is our rules that can be used. So now we will arrive into ln u multiplied by 3z plus 1 raised to 2 all over z minus 1 all equals to c. So we have to remove our ln. So we have to use the Euler's. So e raised to c is just equals to c because it's constant. So we will arrive into u multiplied by 3z minus 1 raised to 2 all over z minus 1 is equals to c. So the next thing to do is use our um, let we let v is equals to u z and we know by a ma manipulation we will arrive z is equals to v all over u so we have to substitute the v i mean the z var variable into v all over u so we arrive in this one so and I did shortcut method in the in this part. So what I did is already distribute the exponent to, and then in the z in the denominator we also have to substitute it with v over u. So we have to cancel all the u because we have to simplify our answers. So in this part we will arrive into 3v minus u multiplied by i mean raised to 2 all over v minus u all equals to c so it can be our it can be our answer but um it's better if we show our answer in simplified form so it's just simple we just have to cross multiply everything and we will arrive into a sim into a simplified simplified version of our answer so our simplified version is simply 3v minus u raised to 2 equals to c multiplied by v minus u so that is our final answer thank you for watching